All right. This is how to reset a spring for a silver step. You've got this top piece needs to be come off. You've got two screws on this side and two on the opposite side, same position. Just use a Phillips screwdriver or this just makes it a little quicker. Once you have the two screws out, this just pulls right out. Set that off to the side. And you'll find that your cloth is all kind of unraveled. What you need to do is retighten that just a little bit. Bring the edge up here to the top like this. Using some masking tape. Tape these edges down. Once you've got that, make sure you have your key located, which is located in the end caps here. They just snap in there. So you'll take this cap off and you'll find it in there. Keep it on this side. And what you want to do is you want to coil the spring in the direction that you want it to come back at. So in other words, that would be the wrong way because that would shoot the stand out this way. I need some more tape to hold this down. Now what I'm doing is recoiling the spring, see, and if, when I get up here to my edge, if I let this go, see how this is coiling back in, that's what you want. I'm going to get it, there's no secret number here, it's on the length of the banner. But you want to get it so it's got enough little force to it that it's going to pull it back in the stand. And keep in mind, you don't want to run this until it's fully tight because it's going to be pulling this out and putting more touch on the spring when you pull the banner out. So that's good about right there. I need to actually count the turns on that real quick. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. We're going to give it ten. Ten full circles. Then, Two holes here in the smaller hole, you put that there and you slowly until that key locks in and that holds your spring into position. And you need to take your masking tape off. fabric out, one layer of it, so that it's outside the machine like this. Return this back into a position. It sets in this back groove right here. So you kind of get that in, kind of get this in. Just a little bit to help kind of get started in there, like so. Line up the holes. Let me turn those screws in.
you've got that in, flip this down. Hold this good because it'll pull it back in. Like so. You might want to come loose. Holding this, pulling out. I'm going to pull my key out. I'm going to pull a little bit more of it out so I've got something to work with. And then reset my key. Okay. Resetting the bar. Have your graphics for the face up. Take the end caps, these little end caps off of your bar if they're not already off. Open this up fully. You want to make sure these ends stay together. I'm just kind of holding that together. Slide that back in there. Make sure your distance is the same from side to side. Make sure it's all the way in. Start in the middle, push down, and then just work out. We'll push down good and hard until this is closed about that much. When it's locked on, it won't go any farther. Then you can return your cap ends. right here, push out a little bit, pull your key back out, and let your stand go in, and it's fixed.